What if I tell you that there is one plugin that customizes your WooCommerce transaction invoices, does taxation and calculates shipping costs automatically. Not just this, using the same plugin, we can send invoices via email and generate product barcodes and pink slips and all of this for free. And wait, this plugin will allow your customers to download invoices for their order like this. Looks good. Now let me show you how I did it. I'll head to my WordPress dashboard, click on plugins, add new plugin and look for the PDF invoice plugin. Here it is. Let's install and activate it. Now on the left, go to WooCommerce and click on PDF invoices. Awesome. Scroll down to company details section and this is where we personalize our invoices. Let's fill out the details one by one. I'll upload my logo by clicking this button like this. Done. Put your shop name in this box and the VAT number in this box right here. You also need to put your address here like this and write terms and conditions if you have any in this box. Next, I'm going to show you how to enable invoices on your e-commerce website and add automatic tax calculations like GST along with shipping charges. But first, let's enable the invoice feature. Head over to our WordPress dashboard, go to WooCommerce and click on PDF invoices. Once you're in the settings, make sure the invoice option is enabled for all orders. This ensures every order gets an invoice automatically. Next, I'll show you how to add automatic tax calculations. So in the WooCommerce settings, go to tax. Here, enable taxes and set up your tax classes. For GST, create a new tax class, name it GST, and add the relevant tax rates based on your region. Once everything is done, do not forget to save your changes from here. Now let's add shipping charges. Go to the shipping tab in WooCommerce settings. Add your shipping zones and methods. Also specify the cost for each. Again, make sure to save the changes. And you're done. To ensure automatic emails are sent to customers, first go to WooCommerce, then move to settings and click on emails. Make sure the email for customer invoice or the details is activated here. Moving on, to make invoices available for download from the customer's account page, go to WooCommerce, click on PDF invoices and click documents. Here, enable the option to show the invoice in the customer's account page. This setting allows customer to access and download their invoices directly from their My Account tab on your website. To enable packaging slips, go to packing slips. Ensure the packing slip document is enabled by checking the appropriate box. And from here, enable and select the details you want in the slip. I'm going to add these three details, which is address, email address, and phone number. Once you've made your selections, save the changes. To see if everything is working properly, I'll go to orders and select the order. Here you can see the button labeled packing slip. Click here and you will see the packing slip right here. We can now download this and attach it to our orders. To download invoices and packing slips in bulk, go to WooCommerce, then orders. Use the checkboxes to select the orders for which you need invoices or packing slips. From the bulk actions drop down menu, choose either download invoices or download packing slips. Once selected, click apply. Now, in the last segment, I'll show you how your customers can download their order invoice straight from their account manager on your website. After logging in, they need to navigate to orders where they'll see a list of their purchases. They can view the order details. Here, a download invoice button will be available, allowing them to download the PDF directly. Comment below if you have any questions and I'll help you out. Click this video if you want to triple your site speed in just one minute. You're really gonna thank me for this. So click here and I'll see you there.